Drop that bitch, man. Three little T, man. Rest in peace to Coop, man. What made me start rapping this day when I was, I was in motherfucking prison, too. I probably was like doing my second bid uh, my whole time now. I had to got into an altercation with an officer and shit. So the cracker fuck around and put me on CM, post management for two years. You feel me? I'm sitting in the cell, took about 24 hours, well, 23 hour lockdown. I'm sitting 23 hour lockdown. Every day you don't shower, so the day you do shower, you 24 hour lockdown. But the days your ass shower, 23, you feel me? I was sitting in the room every day, every day. I used to rap everybody else, man. Shit, I tried that shit. I already freestyling a little bit. I tried that shit and shit. I was putting it together. That shit would have working. I started taking rap and serious. When I got it, I wrote one song. When I got out of when I, when I, when I, when I got out, I wrote a song. I had a couple songs when I was locked up. And when I got out, I actually got in the studio and recorded. I seen the feedback that I was getting from not only my own boys, from everybody I went in on saying, let them let hit a song. They told me to do it. I said, God damn it, you didn't want to do it. Last bitch, you didn't have to say no more. My first rap name was Big B. It always gonna be new, cause that's the name, but God damn it, I had to throw out all Big Duke in the hood. So God damn it, Big Duke, that was my first rap name. I was gonna stick with that shit, too. So I became a king, in the city. You feel me? You know, King Duke, right here on the bed. My first show, I was in the city, I was in the city, I was in the city. <coughs> my first show was that for me. My first big show was I opened up for G Herbo. Shout out to F1 Herbo, man, from Chicago. I opened up for Herbo. Motherfucker. I rock. Fuck out that bitch, man. The crowd go crazy. I think I got footage of that shit still on the page and shit. But I rock that fucker. That bitch was viral. I rock out like a bitch. I feel like this shit can get way better, you feel me? I feel like. It all start with the artists though anyway, you feel me? Cause guess what, I don't really, I don't, like I don't never really ask nobody to push my shit, I do it myself, but I feel like good music, motherfucker gonna push it regardless, you feel me? If they ain't shit it, a bitch gonna push it. Bitch don't like this garbage ass music, but as far as like the temple, like the DJs and all that shit, we, the DJs in our city, well, they don't really, they don't really fuck around like that, man. They don't really throw some other shit on from another city, let them rock out. Boy, individually though, they had a little pick. But hey, it is what it is. Except for what, and I think that was the biggest shit to touch the city with. Except for what we're moving. So just so, like, I swear to God, just because of the Temple World Wind movement, I done met so many people that on my daily, like, like, on my daily journey, like, me every day, like, I wouldn't even say nothing to them. I'm like, like, a, like a chill type person. Like, I don't even really, really, like, talk to a lot of people. But just from that Temple World Wind movement, that shit helped me loosen up. And I knew all the type of motherfuckers now. This one ain't even no rapper rapper. I fuck with the Temple World Wind movement. I'm oh, fucking with the enemy. Oh. Man, listen. I'm finna go over my boy shot. Hey. My boy boy. Nah, this so crazy. I'm finna go believe that I got a mobile studio. In the same motherfucking location, I pulled, my, pulled the mobile studio. Mobile studio right here. Right here. Every time. Hey, look, dude. My boy Mo shot a real trap nigga, too, just like me. Every time my boy was in there dropping this verse, guess what? My boy Paul kept ringing, dog. That was the fun, that was some funny shit because guess what? My dog Extra, I was in the studio with him too. And he said, man, damn, Duke, I can't never get you because your way at all, but your phone stay ringing. I be having to catch the plays, bitch. And guess what? We didn't finish. My boy dropped some of his shit and went to go get that money. I was like, yeah, fuck that shit. We waited over here. My boy came back. He left a couple times. I, I, this is my spot, so bitch, you know. But that was that was a funny story. I don't really know a lot of all this stuff. Bitch, that's one of the niggas that's just like me. I know for a fact. Well, it's a lot of motherfuckers I wanna do music with. But I don't really like the name. I can't really name the ball, but shout out, I do, I gotta shout out that boy Tom, cause he been fucking with the heavy lately. Free that boy Luke Kane, shit, you know. Rocking. Money problems, my niggas get up. Fuck my boy Cheetah Boo, you know, East Side. You know, already know, we already been on this. Uh, uh, some Drake spray and tight shit, you know, way before the rap shit. Man, just shout out all the boys doing their thing. Tune, everybody rush, everybody doing their thing. Man, all you boys doing their thing. Shout out all my own boys up here. See, Yabby, all the boys doing their thing, man. Just a little movement, though.
I don't even really fuck with Walker Mota Madaw as far as Seth Lee. But I feel like he do a good job at what he do. But the other promoters, I do not fuck with him, dog. Because that's why. In every other city, when them artists touch down in them cities, them motherfuckers, the promoters plugging them in with them artists. They ain't just letting them people come get that bag of meat, bro. Y'all ain't doing shit for the city. They getting our money hauling ass. That nigga, yo, see the money bag, yo, talk about it. Walk in, what? Secure the bag, I don't fuck with nobody else. And haul ass. That nigga can't be doing our shit like that. Bitch, gotta, bitch if you gonna bring a nigga to the city, plug him in with a couple artists in the city. Let a nigga get in there. Put him in a video. Put him out. Do it something. Shit, I don't really fuck with promoters. I don't fuck with promoters. Just be patient. Keep riding, man. This shit gonna pop off real soon. Just have patience with the boy. Y'all already know everything I put my mind to. That shit comes to fruition, bro. Anything. So goddamn it, just rock with me. I got the new shit going on. Ain't no new shit. Anybody, wherever you from, you fucking with it, you fucking with it. Hit me up. IG, Facebook. I just got a Facebook. Duke Rose. Goddamn it. IG, man. King D17. Only us records is the promo page, bro. I, I, I do a show. I got a show tomorrow at Truth. You know what I'm saying? They book the nigga. They talk about that, that, that band, right? In the city. Okay. Motherfucker. And I got that motherfucker. Way to be crying to w, WTBC2. That bitch on the way. My second mixtape. Got a lot of shit coming up, man. And I got that one of the hottest motherfucking singers out there. None of these niggas featuring my homeboy Chill Will. That bitch out banging. Heavy. Heavy. Every club you go to in the city. Bang it. Video coming soon for that too. That bitch the highly requested. Well, you can find my music on YouTube, man. King Boo. Find my motherfucking music on SoundCloud. 1217 King Boo. Find me on IG, like I say, King Duke 17. Only Us Records. Underscore, underscore. That's the promo. Facebook, Duke Rose. Get at me. I ain't got no Twitter. I'm finna get me one of them fuckers, but other than that, man, get at me. Reach me. I got plenty of visuals on YouTube. See how a nigga living. See where a nigga come from. Yeah, man, y'all. Man, look. Temple of Win, man. That's the new shit going on in the city, man. Plugging everybody in. Shout out my boy Earl Dog. Shout out Boss Dog for most. Shout out everything. Shout out motherfucking. <clears throat> everybody doing their thing, man. Shout out them boys, man. I'm growing that real skin. Everybody around this motherfucker. Like, everybody look up to somebody. And, and, and guess what? And one thing I understood, and one thing I understand, like, I understand now growing up that you ain't going to look up to nobody who want to do if I bitch can't preach nothing that they want to do, everybody know everything I rap about I do. Everybody know everything that I talk about in the lyrics I do. And they know bitch if they from the hood, so everybody can vouch for the shit I do. So if you a leader of something and everybody, man, and, 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 and you telling them to shoot, and, and you ain't gonna shoot, they know you ain't gonna shoot, why would they shoot? You feel me? They ain't gonna do it. With me, everything I talk about, everything I put forth for them boys, they know I'm gonna do it self. They, oh yeah, that nigga, he ain't gonna tell me to do nothing he wanna do. So that's how I got that shit unitized. Like this shit here walk, bitch, we like an army now. We come out, we everywhere, every hood, we come out, we deep, we rocking. On that script, on the script of me. On the script of bitch, okay, it's a respectable leader. I ain't saying the other niggas weren't respectable, but they probably weren't living how they was talking. You feel me? I'm living that shit. Everybody know that. So what they fucking with me. And all that trap shit I talk about, I do. All that trap shit. Talk about people doing everything I talk about. I do. So this, that's how this shit walk on one accord around right here, man. Underworld, only us rappers. Twelve, seventeen, self-made, six game, all that shit in one. We all support each other over here. And then guess what? And just because I'm the, and yeah, it's another thing. And just because I'm like one of the top dog niggas over here. They don't mean that I don't support the niggas that's up under me. They see all that shit. Boy, they see me upload all that shit. So guess what? Okay, hey, these niggas respect that. That's why they doing the same thing. What they do, boy? They respect that, man. Yeah, yeah. Flat, yeah, yeah. Man, back to the base. Bye. Bitch, we back to the base. Drop that bitch, man. Three little T, man. That's a piece of coat, man. Listen, never lost hope, my nigga. Back to the basic on the block, we chase it. If it ain't about the